All right, guys, welcome back. I know I've been absent for two weeks. It's been a crazy, crazy holiday uh, at work, especially doing all the tours. But I hope all of you guys had a wonderful Christmas and a happy, happy new year. In this video, we're going to explore the mysterious swept away boats inside of the mangroves at Big Hickory. Sit back and enjoy. Enjoy. Uh, welcome to 2023 whole new year um, I know I probably look a little goofy with this on but today I ha today's been a little bit of an interesting day so originally I planned to spearfish today and kind of show you guys something different other than um, hurricane updates and you know I checked the tide chart if y'all don't know usually Big Hickory Island yes I'm here on Big Hickory today uh, with an incoming tide it's usually clear and i was checking the wind chart and yes it's at like 15 knots which is like 16 miles an hour uh, when it gets really windy it can stir up the sediment and make it really murky now the direction of the wind is kind of like it's coming from this way so I didn't know whether or not it'd be clear or murky. It was kind of like a 50-50 shot because sometimes the trees can block the wind and you don't feel the wind on a windy day. So that's what I was kind of thinking it'd be like. Uh, but no, I was mistaken. So I do have my spear gun on the paddleboard. I tried doing it earlier. and uh it's just not gonna happen so that's unfortunate but always be prepared when things don't go right so i was thinking what could i do as a backup plan well i got a backup plan for you guys and that is the lost boats from hurricane ian so i do have to transverse over there and i don't have shoes this is about as beavis and butthead as it can possibly get but life is one giant adventure guys so i've got my ghost post strap on no shoes I'm gonna try to walk up to these uh boats and see what's up so this is a starcraft i'm gonna try to get the boat numbers and whoever's boat this is if you don't know this is your boat by now hopefully you can find this video Quicksand sediment. I hope this uh, top one's going. Yeah, it's going. Okay, so let's do this. I'll put this up. Literally. Oh my gosh. This is how I get hurt, guys. Don't do what I'm doing. Um, use your brain cells and make smart decisions with your day. YOLO! Sounds like some people are having a good time over there. So yeah, there's a couple boats here. There's one here. And then, uh, making sure my paddleboard's still there. If that goes away, it'll float down. I'll have to swim to it. Alright. This is wild that a boat came here huh? and these are so like well placed that I really think someone put these here be kind of coincidental that they didn't ow Ooh. yowza no blood that hurt okay let's see what's on here here's the uh Boat number. I'm 
Luthier FL2132RJ. So if that's your boat, it's a StarCraft. Um, sorry that happened to your boat. Let's see, it's up here. Obviously I'm not gonna take anything, but I might as well hop on and see what the heck is up with these boats. Ugh. Yeah. Got all kinds of crap here. Sad. I'm sure whoever's boat this was. I, I think I know whose boat this is. Um, if I'm not mistaken, it was some Hispanic family that always came out here. I could be wrong, but they had a very similar boat, and um, my mom knew them. One of them, uh, one, I think it was the wife, she built something up, some sort of business, and bought this boat. I could be mistaken, but there is the boat number there. This is a Starcraft out in the little mangrove island. And there is another boat. There's a little fountain center console. I'm going to try to transverse through this. And uh, possibly try to make it through. Yeah, you want to turn off because you get too hot, huh? Okay. It tied on there. All right. Uh, okay, so that's this boat taken care of. It is over to this boat right over there. Um, it is going to be tricky. I don't know if any of this is quicksand, so it it. Let's just try it. <laughs> yeah. All right. First, I got to get down this. Okay, that could have been smoother. My, my going. All right, this top camera's live. It's a little bit tricky doing two cameras at once. But you know, if you guys want to see what it's like to walk through mangroves, um, you know, you clicked on the perfect video. Never thought my life would go like this, but one moment you're trying to spearfish, and the next moment you're trying to climb through a freaking mangrove island to go up to boats from a hurricane that was a one in 500 year storm um yeah life is you know kind of a crazy thing when you really put everything in perspective like i'm uh, on a planet that can host life floating around a giant ball of plasma um in a body that has been on this planet for quite a long time on an island transversing through mangroves try not to fall got my spider balance senses on but yeah you know life is kind of crazy you kind of just think back it's like you guys clicking on the video you know the matrix runs deep all right. Um, what have I got myself into is the big question. I'm doing pretty well though. Okay. It's kind of a different perspective once you're back here. I was smart for putting my flag on the paddle board because I can't see it from here. All right, it's not the, it's not as quick sandy as I thought it'd be. Cause why not? All right, whoa, that was close. Um, I'm getting closer though. This is kind of cool. I've never really been on this ledge before because no one in their right mind would walk through crap like this. 
but finally you've been given a pretty good reason to. Thought I heard something. Alright. so closer I just really hope my paddleboard doesn't float away that would really make it today a little bit uh, a little bit worse All right, so I made it to the second boat. Ugh. Uh, I've officially gone crazy, guys. I really have, but that's the little engine to it. This looks like it's just like a kind of like a center console fountain. Spiders have already taken this over. Look at that. Let's see if you guys, I don't know if y'all can see it. I'll have to check back, but there's like 30 spider nests on this thing. Oh wow, there's one right here too. Look at them. They're all over the place on this boat. Holy crap. I almost walked into like a freaking landmine. Look at this. Spider web, spider web, spider web, spider web, big old spider web. Try to walk on this, see if I can dodge him. Alright, I'm going to try to get the boat number on this guy because you know some people might not know that their boats have uh, gotten washed up like this spider webs up here man I don't even know what you can do with a boat like this like the leather's ruined the hull actually looks good but you know the engine's shot all that it's a really sad situation but um, I don't know if I can get that but I'll do it upside down just crop it but that says FL four seven eight eight PR. What the f is that? Maybe I set off a bomb, guys. <laughs> what the hell? Is there like a ring system for uh, for boats? That's the case, that's pretty crazy. I'm gonna fly my drone around. I think there is one more boat down the ways, like down over there. Maybe I'll have to get back on my paddleboard and go down a little bit, but this is one of the other boats.
Oh well, I guess I'll just walk through the flipping spider webs, YOLO. Here's the center console. So this is what they call it, ro Robalo. A Robalo center console. Alrighty guys, that concludes it for today's video. Uh, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button if you haven't already. Also, a huge announcement, we just surpassed 900 subscribers. So, I just want to thank everybody that subscribed. That is just a crazy milestone. We are about to hit 1K, which is a huge milestone for the channel. Honestly, never really thought we'd get that big. All the hurricane update videos I put up, you know, especially the one that got, it was the hurricane, uh, big hickory, little hickory update. The first video got 55,000 views, if I'm not mistaken. That was my first voiceover, so the amount of traction this has gotten really just blew me away because I just put that up being happy if I was going to get 200 or 300 views. So I'm really happy that I could help you guys out with all this stuff. Um, the channel is going to be making some changes towards uh, different content, obviously, because hurricane updates will only last a certain amount. So I'm going to bring you guys like spear fishing, fishing, just basic boating life. So that's what Florida is all about, living on the water. So you guys stay tuned for that. Uh, if you have any friends or family that are interested in this video, or, you know, the outdoors, hurricane updates, anything like that. Share them this channel. Por favor. Anyways, guys, y'all have a blessed day. And thank you for watching. Bye.